Who does this benefit? It would seem like pulling their people out of the United States is not to Russia's advantage. Well, I think that Putin uh, believes that he uh, showed a very robust response uh, to the sanctions bill that was passed. He's probably also calculating um, that uh, the U.S. administration won't respond uh, to this. I mean, he said that uh, in a television interview, uh, which was broadcast yesterday, uh, that Russia would not take any further measures, and he hoped uh, that, th that they would draw a line over this. Henry, is this an overreaction? I mean, at some point, will these people have to be allowed back into Russia or at least proxies? Uh, or will relations deteriorate quicker and faster than we would like to believe? Well, you can say that it's an overreaction, but I don't think uh, there's going to be a reversal of this step. It's a sweeping decision. Uh, I mean, the numbers, of course, are huge. Um, and um, I think that, uh, you know, Putin has made the calculation that the relationship with the United States is not going to get any better. Uh, he really has lost hope uh, that uh, under the administration of Donald Trump, uh, the relationship could be improved. Are we entering into a sort of a tit-for-tat spiral, Henry, of retaliation here? That's certainly the risk. I mean, I, I did say that uh, Putin has made the calculation that the U.S. won't respond. But if it does, uh, you heard those comments from the deputy foreign minister just now. Russia has pledged to, to match any further expulsions uh, of Russian diplomats from the U.S., um, so, yes, you could get into a situation where uh, you have a spiral of, of these retaliatory measures. It's a risk.